Well, hello there, nerds. As you can see here, I did a summoning session with a little bit of the free-to-play orbs that I managed to scrounge up finally. Did a bit more of chain challenges, working on some squad assault videos for you guys for fun, and also arena stuff. But, uh, you know, I figured, hey, look, <laughs> let's try summoning. It didn't go too well. Didn't go too well. I wanted to see if I could do one more thing with the summer banner, but, eh, it, it, it seems like... You know, that's just, oh, okay. Well, I had to send home some units. That was a little awkward to start off with, but I'm just going to say a few things. One, uh, orb contest thing, it will, <laughs> we won't be having the winners from yesterday's video today. Instead, we're going to be hosting, you know, just all you have to do is post a comment, say what your, uh, you know, region and OS is, and just talk to me. You don't have to, you know, I would like it if you could say something nice and not be jerks in the comments to each other, but uh, hey, if you if you, if you you do that, you'll probably be disqualified. Just saying. Still, nonetheless, uh, just all you have to do. Um, we will be selecting the winners for this video and yesterday's video in tomorrow's video because I have very little time on my hands to do things right now, and I just wanted to see if we could talk about something real quick as a conversation piece because a lot of you were asking. Um, first up, well, <laughs> I, I guess we'll, I, uh, I'm also going to just say real quick that I have been working on some videos with, uh, the squad assaults and chain challenges, and I have a lot of funny videos for that, filled with terrible gameplay and just general outtakes, but also me doing them reliably well, so, because I've been requested to do so, and it'll be out soon with some hilarity because I'm bad at this game, but... Either way. Anyways, let's uh, let's talk about what's going on here, shall we? With this lovely little team that I have here. The Noob Squoo. <laughs> Featuring Celica, I guess. But mostly, a lot of you were asking about something. Well, not most of you. Um, someone came up to me and asked me what I meant by the Asker Trio. And when I talked about the Fae Channel, and I'm hoping that they would touch upon this. Well... Right now, uh, these three units in, these, in this game are the, well, original characters of the game. Well, technically, Anna is a reiteration of, you know, Anna as always, but these two, you know, the siblings, uh, they're new. They're completely original characters for this game, and because of that, um, well, tip, well, typically you kind of need to have a little bit more going for them, and right now you kind of can get them up to five stars, and getting them up to five stars does unlock things like legendary weapons and... Usually it's just a good idea to get these characters up at least in level anyways, because, well, you're going to be using them for a lot of things, guys. You're, <laughs> you're going to be using them for, um, you know, all sorts of quests, Tempest Trials occasionally, Arena has them as a specialty bonus unit, at least they usually do, and, you know, all sorts of stuff. They're valuable for many reasons, but most of all it's just because, well, they're free-to-play units, and when they, sh you know, you get them at the start of the game, and because of that, it doesn't hurt to get them up because if you don't have any other units that you feel like you can use, they will serve you well enough. Um, but the problem is, these three units, as they are, do have some problems. Um, mostly, in that as, you know, the game has gone on, they, they've kind of lost a lot of their appeal, and the unfortunate thing is, they also have a disadvantage that a lot of other units, well, every other unit doesn't have. Um, that, of course, is the fact that no matter what, you can't merge them at all. Not only that, but uh, there's just, you know, certain characters like Alphonse here. He's he's kind of stuck with a really bad le a legendary weapon. I mean, Defiant Attack is cool and all, but uh, not something I would really want on a weapon. It's kind of like how certain characters kind of have that problem. Celef, you know, even Witch now, he kind of has a... Eh, kind of weapon, but still, nonetheless, um, just in general, they're not the strongest units you can get, and since they're supposed to be the mainstay characters, I, I think it might be a good idea to come back to this, I don't know if this is going to happen this, you know, time, but they're probably going to touch these characters come the anniversary, the full year anniversary, I believe that's in March or February, I forget exactly when the launch date of this game was, but February or March, and when it comes to these characters, well, you kind of need to, you know, <laughs> even to give you an example, a lot of g other gacha games, like uh, I've been playing some more Fate Stay Go, um, even if you get a character that is, you know, three stars, they can still be extremely valuable. Some of them are even more valuable than five stars in some ways. And I feel like 
since these characters are such a prevalent thing in the story, which even though the story mode of this game is beautiful, thumbs up, um, I, I still think that maybe this may be a time to maybe address them. Now, a lot of people, they're going to be like, well, what could you do? Well, the first thing I'd say that would go a long way towards making them more valuable is making a way for you to merge them, or at least give them plus one, plus two, you know, make them a little bit stronger than what they are, because right now they don't have that ability, and they probably won't have that ability. Um, I don't think they're going to be added to a gotcha, you know, crank. I don't think they're going to be brought out in another banner as something crazy, but um, generally, I think as characters, they could stand to have some different form or different way to at least expand upon them because a merge would go a long way to at least making them a lot better because, well, a lot of other units, even at four stars, when merged, are really valuable and pretty helpful. Um, still, though, that's just one idea. The other idea that I oftentimes see people toss around for these characters is the simple fact that, well, why don't we bring in the one tradition that Heroes has, uh, not Heroes, Fire Emblem has, and, uh, you know, make it about them. And that, of course, is class promotion. Would would you guys be into that? Um, because that's been a tradition that's been in Fire Emblem for a long time. You know, taking one character and promoting them, making them stronger, changing their class, changing, I, I, I wouldn't say movement type, but making them stronger, maybe giving them different loadouts and things like that when you do promote them. Things like that. Would that work for these? These are probably the only characters that I can see in Heroes that could actually do this. That could actually make something out of, well, you know, promotion. Because otherwise, you know, we're gonna, you know, I, I don't think you can take Naoi and, you know, promote her into a witch, but I'm just saying that, you know, the idea of a gacha game would probably work better without adding class promotion to everyone, but it would really work well for the Asker Trio. And, of course, that would come with some sort of compensation and something that you probably would have to either spend orbs on or something else valuable to your time. So, yes, I, I do see class promotion as an option, but I don't know how that would work too well in Heroes. A lot of you have been like, they need to make it, they need to make it so these characters can, like, promote and just go out there and do their stuff. And, yeah, that would be cool because, I mean... Sharina has a really great weapon, Anna has an okay weapon, and then Alphonse is just kind of there. Um, I don't, you know, Alphonse is more acquainted with the bench nowadays than anything else, and that kind of sucks for a free unit that, you know, is such a mainstay in the story and is oftentimes something that you're going to, you know, want to use when it comes to getting orbs and things. So, I would really see them touching, this, uh, touching upon this because... All in all, they're strong units, they just need a little bit more of a push in the right direction, especially now since, well, we have so many new <laughs> new characters that have come out in recent banners that have been purely power creep. Just purely power creep. And just, you know, it's been like, hey, here's here's your one unit and here's Ira, it's way up there, and here's Sigurd, who, you know, just is a tank in every way and can still deal out a lot of damage. It's just... It's something that I am looking forward to, at least something I think will happen. Because these three characters are free to play, and I honestly see them as being something that a lot of people will end up using. And just disregarding them would be a disservice to them because they have become actually quite popular. And right now, you can't do much of, well, anything to them. And because of that, they quickly fall behind. Uh, you know, no merging. That sucks. That really does hurt them in the long run, but it would help if you had a way to merge them beyond that. I'm sure maybe you could, uh, you know, tie something to a master seal and make that the merge or something like that. I don't know. What do you guys think? Figured I would just talk about this. Would you like class change? Would you think class change would work for these three, only these three characters, not any of the other characters, guys? There's no way that's happening. They, they need to get, you know, they need to let you roll on this nonsense and go for it. In fact, you know what? Just because I'm, I said that, I'm going to roll anyways. Because, you know, Halloween banner is a fun time. Yeah, green, go! <laughs> Not going to get anything, but hey, it's going to be fun. Yeah, three star, my favorite. Go team. All right, it's a barst. Oh boy, that's exciting. Anyways, so yes, do tell me what you guys think when it comes to uh, class changes. Do you, do you think that's going to be fun, or would would you disagree with that? Oh boy, I still have to... God dang it. That's how I'm going to end this video, guys. Leave a comment, 
give me your region and all that fun stuff. We'll we'll talk about this later. Anyways.